It all started like pretty much any good Swedish story. Me sitting alone, looking quite depressed by my IKEA table and occasionally adjusting my Bob Eats sweater for no good reason. That's when the phone rang Hello. and on the other end was a excited Tom from Synth Anatomy. He told me that Tomman wanted to do a synthesizer event for all the coolest synth people. And I could come as well. Synthesizer, yeah, yeah. Of course I said yes and I sat down in my favorite IKEA chair and waited. And waited. And occasionally adjusted my Bob Eats sweater for no good reason. Then suddenly something happened and there was a post. A post with a house that we were staying in. With the rain pouring down on us in a bus, we headed out to Tommen, but a rumor started to circulate. On the way here, we heard rumors about tents. Um, the tents? The tents? To be honest, I, I don't really get it. It could be in a house. Yeah? And yeah, there was a house. The haunted mansion. The event wasn't really any good, um, to be honest. It was actually uh, awesome, <laughs> really, really awesome, as you'll see. Yeah, here's the tent with the beautiful Rob paper Oh yeah, I'm also <laughs> Have you all here in one spot? In a tent? In Treppendorf? I mean, that's mind-blowing, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> It's pretty good, bro. We get to play on all of this stuff. Whenever. Whenever. It's crazy. Simon the Man Time. Sponsored by Monster. Drink. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, shit. The whole event. event sponsored by Monster. Dang. Here's my, here's my boy, Michelle. Yes. I'm so happy to see you, finally, <laughs> after all these years. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Good morning. So I'm here with uh, Synth Mania. Hey, hello. hello. Yes. Hi, Bo. That's awesome. At Toman's. First time, time we meet also. First time we meet in person. So how, yeah. how do we feel about the tent? I'm overwhelmed. I, I, I don't want to leave ever. When they said tent, I, I was yeah. picturing like these weak, uh, weak white, cheapo tents. Yeah. But this... This, this is, is really well done. So I have my good friend, Mr. Noir, <laughs> Steven here. You haven't eaten breakfast. I didn't know the hotel had breakfast. You didn't know the hotel had breakfast. Okay. So ugly. <laughs> uh, yeah. You know, I had a nice croissant and I had bread. I had... Oh my God. <laughs> and they really did? Yeah, they had good coffee too, you know. It works, it, works, it works really good. Kind of Noir got some breakfast, finally. It's more important than gear. <laughs> Heading back to the hotel after a first day, I think people were less anxious and more intrigued. So it's almost midnight here at Tommen. It's the first or second day, depending on how you look at it. We came yesterday with the flights. Yeah, woke up, have some breakfast, gone on a bus to the, to the site, to the campus got to see the tents because they had literally put up tents and then we got to see the production studios or the, the, the video studios which were really impressive to be honest and of course it's a totally different thing shooting something on site like this uh you know it's just one take you know and it's a very different thing from, from being at home like most of us are 
and to just kind of let go of that control. There was also a really good vibe with many of the manufacturers and the representatives, not this corporate vibe, not kind of silly, you know. So yeah, I, I, I genuinely felt there was a really yeah, cool vibe around the whole thing and got a lot of other collab things, but right now I'm just very, very tired. So guys, thank you for watching this little vlog here. Um, yeah, talk to you later. Every morning after breakfast, we were picked up by a bus and shipped off to the Toman campus. So, uh, my boy Steven. I'm so tired. I'm so tired. Ah. Do you have like a thing? What's up? What's Peter up? Peter 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 <laughs> Are you getting used to the camera in your face all the time? Yeah. I'm yeah. so blase about it these days. Yeah, it's like, uh, I even photo bombed something. I mean, that's so out of character. Oh, you can't have two no. people vlogging. Being, being our little vlog here. Tom, how are you? Tom here sent the net to me on YouTube as well. Uh, been one of the guys who've been organizing this whole event. Did you actually do a head count this morning in the bus? You counted us? Yeah. I think it's amazing the, the tight ship that you're yeah. running here. Yeah. How have you been feeling? Tired. <laughs> because last night was very, very long. Ströme? Ströme. Ströme. Henning, also one of the organizers, also a YouTuber. Bam, bam, bam. <laughs> bam, 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 bam. I really wanted to ask you, Henning. Yes. I really, you were a part of the guitar event? I came up with them. You, you came up with them? This is my idea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So how does it feel to actually have like a, a music event this time? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Paolo, how, how has it been for you? Fantastic, fantastic. Well, what's the best thing so far? Uh, really, it was like everybody else is saying, the unique opportunity to meet yeah. YouTubers. Here, let's see. And you have, you have experience from other trade shows as well, right? Yes, yes. And this one is a little bit different because it's, so, it's smaller, it's, it's more it's warmer because you really get to know all the other people mm. and um, the recording studios were amazing yeah. as well the crew there did a fantastic job yeah the event was pretty cool it was really quite unique i guess i didn't really know what to expect i think none of us really knew what to expect nah, for sure but uh the, the highlights i guess or the things that stand out is the staff is super nice i know this sounds like a paid promo but like genuinely the, the yeah, yeah, yeah the staff everyone they basically they don't say no to anything. <laughs> Super cool. I hope it happens again. But, Do you want to go? Uh, we'll see. Oh yeah, for sure. I want to go. So good. Ah, yes. Here's the synths. Mmm, yes, give me, give me. With delay. I just haven't recovered, you know? <laughs> yeah, I've got some bits to try and um, set up a little uh, stage performance. So I'm here with uh, Dr. Mix. How are you feeling the event so far? Well, it's it's like I feel like a ping pong ball, you know. Uh, but there is so much to see. I mean, these Tom and guys are really incredible. I mean, the amount of instruments and uh, and what they put together, you know, getting us all here and yeah. get you know get to relate to each yeah, other definitely. and uh, make some music, make some videos together. This is what we like to do. This is what we live for. You know, making music, making videos, and share some good love. How's the event been for you so far? Very awesome, very awesome. The best part was like hanging out with the YouTubers, cause you know we're friends on social. Like after a while, you yeah, after a while you get to know who makes the YouTube videos, right? And you know you add them on social and you chat with them every once in a while. But being able to really make that connection, like that human connection in person, it's been really awesome. Like. I haven't been disappointed by anybody. Oh yeah, we jammed. Yeah. <laughs> and talking about the videos, we shot a ton of content during TSR 19. And I think the main takeaway is that the event was geared around the YouTubers, the creatives, and not the brands. We held the power. We decided what we wanted to do. And that was just so cool and quite different from other types of synth events. This is just kind of a, a after action report. We just shot a tutorial, uh, electron tutorial. How was it guys, like honest? It was fun and like I said, like learning something is always great. And if you have a, a, a tutor like right next to you, I think that's the greatest experience you can have, right? Yeah. Cool. Yeah, here, especially here, um, I know they were like, oh, it's not like NAM. And I think that's what this really helped for everyone is like, yeah. it's us, 
sharing our skills like with other people because at somewhere like NAM, you feel like you're bothering someone to have yeah, one. Here, yeah, yeah. it's like, I know that you do it. So it's like, mm. hey, he can help me. Right. So yeah, this is yeah, really I'm fun. Yeah, I'm so glad you wanted to, to yeah, join me and do yeah, it. Like, I, I felt you. I talked a bit too much, but uh, yeah. No, thank <laughs> you. Yeah, awesome. And I think it went, yeah. went by quick, right? Hi there. One of the hardest working guys. You're, ah, that's not true. All the crew is working very hard. <laughs> we actually did our last video now for the event. Yep. Cool. With Mark Doughty talking about Synthesis. Synthesis was really cool. I'll just let you see it. Hey guys. Beyonce. Hey Rage. Two girls, one synth, not what you think. So. I didn't know how the YouTubers would react to each other, you know? And seeing this group coming together was really. The bow. The bow. Le bow. Le bow. Lebo. <laughs> it was really cool actually. It was like you saw that YouTubers first went like hmm hmm and there and there and there and after three days it's like a whole community. It's really really cool. That was a real highlight. How are you experiencing the whole event? Wow, the event is pretty pretty interesting. I yeah. mean there's a lot of people that you usually don't meet in your everyday life, you know? It's not just like on a trade show where you see all the people who want to sell stuff, but you see really curious little kids eyes that want to mess with <laughs> machines and hopefully also with some software that yeah, we present. Yeah. It's, it's great because I, you know, I meet all you guys that, you know, I've been watching your channels, I've been watching your videos and to actually meet up and see that everyone is so cool. It's and it's also really cool because I've been watching your videos. So, I mean, that's humble. <laughs> it's been a lot of fun. I, I've made some new friends like like Bo, yeah. which is really cool. I was really excited about that. The weather was shitty though. I really regret that. But other than that, everything just went smoothly and uh, yeah. fun and nice. I love it. Has it been stressful? Not as stressful as I as I thought it would be. It's actually been quite nice. And and people are good at setting up their gear. It's not taking taking too long to set. Like this was like what five minutes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's cool. So, so, so we have plenty of time and everything is doing their best. How are you feeling? I'm feeling better now than like ever, yeah. I think. Um, had a good time here. It was a little bit much sometimes, to be yeah, honest. Yeah, it yeah. was. Like, yeah. this is kind of a weird situation to be here when you're like a normal person or like a YouTube person or whatever. Yeah, if you're, if you're like a non-normal person like me, it's, uh -huh. it's more okay. Yeah, yeah, it's okay for me too. It's okay for me too. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm sure. had a, a tremendous time and I had a, yeah, it, I've, I've been doing a lot of videos, but yeah. not too much. Yeah, sure. Yeah, and but I'm it's taking, taking you a little time to kind of uh, uh, get, get into the groove of things. Yeah, and I think that's kind of like, that's, that's what you do with yeah, yeah, yeah. being. Yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. But I feel like I've got more out of this than I expected yeah. in the end. So sure. I'm really happy about this. And just being able to like meet the people, meet all of you guys. I've seen you before and it's not that special. To <laughs> it's not that special. <laughs> yeah, man, we're going to shape up yeah. and do the, do the clap. <laughs> How are you feeling the event so far? Oh, amazing. Really amazing. You know, when we first arrived, we were a little bit like, what is this? <laughs> and then the next day, it's like, oh. And then the next day, oh. And it's just been, I think it's amazing. Really. What, what has been the most uh, exciting thing so far? Wow. Um, Simon the Magpie and Look yeah. Mom No Computer, a repair of very yeah. crazy man. When I came in, I wasn't sure what to think. And now I'm like, yeah, it was fun as heck. And I think we got some really good content, everybody. Like, everybody's been just like working their asses off right just wanted to get the most content out of it right uh yeah yeah we i'm 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 done give us a head count like how how many things did you break <laughs> <laughs> but actually we didn't you break broke a drum kit we don't know we might have broken a spring reverb tank okay might okay yeah and i mean that's with a sledgehammer essentially <laughs> Like actual sledgehammer. So we obviously broke the most squishy thing. Is the whole. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But for science, for science, yeah, yeah. you know. For we got science. all the nice little. Oh yeah. Tools. Oh no, you haven't done it no, yet. No, no, no. no. We got it. You know the shadow heel master compressor. 
Oh, wow, the take up the whole side. Whole side. Uh, the uh, keyboards. Uh, so yesterday, Simon wanted to make the longest guitar lead. Oh, yeah, 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 I know, yeah. And uh, so I was a little bit involved in that and giving a bit of a co running commentary, <laughs> running along. <laughs> Yeah, it's cool. uh, over 900 meters yeah, yeah, long, yeah, 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 yeah. and just the idea that, and Tomon going, yes, we'll help you do it. You know, I think when, when we first were invited, we all thought, hmm, what, what is this thing? Like you said, just, yeah. and the fact that, you know, with the brands that we can do things with, but there's no expectation, you can make a 900 meter guitar cable, <laughs> yeah. they've been breaking instruments, they've been up for letting you do stuff, yeah. you want to pull stock out of the warehouse. Yeah, I mean, a jam, we had a jam, didn't we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. at Synth event, and, and Gas says, I want to play, play some drums and bass. Yeah, and, that was nice. and they accommodate it. I believe that's Dr. Mick. <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> we were staying at a really nice hotel. It was some kind of mansion, I suppose. The accommodations were great, the breakfast and the hotel room, except for one minor thing. With the weirdest toilet roll dispenser. So every day we were shooting videos between 10 and 6 in the evening and then we ended the day with dinner together. One of the most enjoyable experiences this event was just sitting down every breakfast, talking to other creatives, sharing our experiences and just getting to know each other. I just wanted to ask you, like, how's the event been for you so far? It's been a lot of fun. Yeah. Basically, uh, on the f I arrived, I didn't... Mm -hmm. You, 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 they put up in these tents, as you've seen probably already, <laughs> but um, I didn't go into the tent. I only mm. was in the beginning area, took, drank three coffee, mm. and then I went straight to the piano room and recorded something oh, on yeah. the disc clavier for three hours. And after I've done that, I was super relaxed. It was yeah. just, uh, it was something I wanted to do, I explicitly asked for to do, mm -hmm. and I just did it because it was something I've been wanting to for 15 years. We talk about community yeah. often, like, the, but there isn't really a community. We're all basically, in the end, we're often all alone in our <laughs> editing studios. Yeah, yeah, sure. And sure. being able in the run-up to this, being able to talk about things. Yeah, for sure. And like clearing all the questions that we have. And um, that's been super helpful. Yeah. So, because we all struggle, even if we do different things, we struggle with the same hmm. problems. For and sure. the same things, and we learn from each other. Yeah. So, and you can help. Saturday night, we got to see a really cool Eurac live show with a system probably worth more than your house. And yeah, it was pretty cool. Did a little live stream from there, and here's a little clip of that. It's been really nice to meet all the people you usually see on the screen, to meet uh, all you guys in person. It's been nice to see all the nice gear. So basically it's been a really nice event because it's nice people, nice gear and nice conversations around music and community. We didn't expect it, that the YouTubers can, will come up with such a bunch of crazy ideas and that the YouTubers will cooperate such that much. We didn't expect yeah, yeah. it. We thought that everyone is doing his own stuff, shooting videos, but we, now it's crazy that all the people getting together, shooting videos together which is really great. I did not expect how the YouTubers would interact with, the, uh, with each other, um, but this surprised me the most that you guys are so open-minded and you're so interested in meeting each other people and cooperating and doing crazy stuff together. This was unexpected. Is there any, anything that sort of surprised you so far about the event? Yeah, you, the YouTubers, are so nice and friendly and kindly and <laughs> yeah, that's really cool. <laughs> In southern Germany, in the middle of all the cows, one man 
a couple of sins and a dream. And he, um, actually, when we work, last walk up to the cafeteria, it's actually, yeah, it's actually a little sad. Sure, there might be other events like this, but uh, yeah, it'll stay with me for quite some time. I've had a lot of interesting conversations and I feel like I've accomplished the main thing that I set out to do. Yeah, push myself to, to yeah, get out of my comfort zone, do more music, jams, just hang out. So now I'm gonna see if I can sit down and just catch my breath because I'm, I'm actually a little bit tired, so. Hello, staff people. Hello. Hello. The video I've seen, the content you created, the ideas you had over the last four days were just outstanding. So on behalf of Tom and on behalf of the whole team, thank you very, very much for coming over. It's been an honor and great pleasure. So now I'm feeling a little bit sad that, that I have to go home. Of course, I'm missing my family, but uh, it was really nice being here. Such a weird and crazy experience, and I'm really thankful. Um, for you guys who are supporting on YouTube, which let me do these kind of things. And to Tommen for arranging it, but mostly to all the other YouTubers and the staff who made this all possible. So thank you so much. I hope we can do it again next year. I'll definitely be coming if you'll have me. So thank you so much. Talk to you later.